go. Good game. Good luck. GGGL. <laughs> good game. Sometimes I mistap. Like, I actually want to say good luck, and I say good game, and I'm like, oh. Yeah. I didn't mean to Offensive BMU. GG <laughs> yeah. before the game even starts. You just see the good in it, and you just want to tap it right yeah. away. Well, I mean, GGGL was a very common thing to say at the beginning of many other games as well. So, Zeke and Boya learning from that, I suppose. So, so far, very similar things here. Ice Golem, Mega Minion, Log. Log coming from Econ Boya. <laughs> okay. They both have Log. Now will we see an Ice Spirit. Okay, here comes the Giant. So, Mikan Boya going with the Giant beatdown deck. The Cannon Cart in response from KK. Coming out pretty early here. It is going to get to about the bridge before it does start firing. It's kind of unfortunate, though, because it's really not going to get all that much value. It does stop the giant and help to get a lot of poison damage onto it, but the rest of it still pushing on in here. The Electro Wisher really helping out in the defense. Yep, so that giant's not going to quite get in there. Neither will the Mega Minion. Everything just kind of resets a little bit here. They're both pretty even in Elixir. I guess you've still got that defensive cannon card if you're Mikan Boya. Hang your hat on that. Yeah. But we still haven't seen the last two cards from KK, and we're still missing one from Mikan Boya. Giant minion horde, of course. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here it is. Lumberjack. Okay. So going for, yeah, a beatdown deck here. Focused around the giant with the, the Lumberjack to come in and give us that little rage spell when he dies this time. Nothing behind him doing. Poison comes down to counter that cannon card. So a bit of damage there. The, the, the Furnace now is one of KK's other cards. So that's interesting. Hasn't shown that last one, but comes in with the Electro Wizard, makes that cleanup extremely easy. So far, another very close game here with a minute left. Still waiting on the reveal of the final card here from KK. Yeah, Mikan Buya split pushing now down the right hand side lane, dropping that Lumberjack in to get the Rage first. The cart and a Mega Minion coming up behind it. There's the Rage. Can he get anything done with this? That Giant walks a lot faster when he's Raged. Yeah, trying to block it here and get that Mega Minion to not attack it, but a Zap comes in and gets even more damage with the Giant. Mega Minion unfortunately going to hit the cannon here, but should get one extra shot, actually. No, not quite towards the end. A really nice split push from Mikan Boya. KK answering with the Furnace Ooh. on the left-hand side. Ooh, and a Graveyard is the last card to come out here from KK. And the cannon gets in range. That's a huge push coming on in. Mikan Boya trying to respond on the right side, but the Furnace blocks the Giant, and now only 400 health onto that left side Princess Tower. That's just two poisons for KK to take down that left hand Princess Tower. So, Mikan Boy is going to have to play aggressively to keep him from, al from allowing KK to use those poisons offensively, but here comes the Graveyard. Surely the poison will be not too far behind. Look at the Lumberjack on the right side, has to respond to that first foremost. He's gonna block and still gets one shot there. That means that no follow-up after that graveyard can come in. Still hesitating on using the poison. Still a ton of time left over before this game goes out. Yep, okay, he's opting to push the left-hand lane again here. The, the furnace comes down in response immediately. The carts are gonna duel each other. Here comes the Lumberjack to try to get in and do some damage. Get that Rage drop for Mikan Buya. Gonna die here for quite a while, actually. Just aggro onto the top side as well, the Ice Golem. And the cannon card on the right side. Can it get in range? Yes, it can. There's no defense. The graveyard on the top left side. But oh. who's going to win? One more shot from the cannon. But no, the graveyard takes it out. And KK is able to take out Meek and Boya. Wow. That came down to the wire there. That, that wow. cannon cart, one more shot, takes down that tower. But that graveyard, very nicely timed from KK to get the win.